Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. This video is such an exciting video for me. I know I look the same as the last video. I mean, I don't know what order I'm putting it up, but this is my first ever Kringle candle haul. I'm so excited, but Kringle did send me all these candles. Can you believe that? I am in complete and utter shock. They sent me all of this. I've never tried Kringle candles before. I always see Bonnie on here talking about it and I've always wanted to. My curiosity is there. I've been on the website multiple times and I've just, I'm so excited to try them, finally try them. I haven't even opened the box, I'm not gonna lie. It's been sitting in my room since the beginning of November. So I've had this box unopened in my room for about a month and I just didn't wanna open it off camera so that's why I just kept pushing it and kept pushing it. Today's the day. I wanna smell everything with you guys for the first time. I just wanna see what it's about. I do know, so the cool thing is I do know that Kringle Company is, so Yankee Candle is the father and Kringle Company is the son. So you know it's gonna be great quality cause it's Yankee Candle's child. Come on, it can't be bad. So I'm so excited to open this, this box. I have no idea what's inside of it. I literally don't have a clue. So we're about to open this box together. Can you see this? It's heavy. It is so well taped. Like, can you see this? They put so much tape on. It's heavy, guys. It is heavy. It's like, I would say like 20, 30 pounds. It is heavy. Oh, on, on the box, it says 21 pounds. So this thing is heavy. And I do have a coupon code. Oh my God, they even gave me a coupon code. By the way, the coupon code, I will put it down below. I'll put it in the description. The coupon code is Erica15. And you so you would get 15% off. So my coupon code is Erica15 and you can actually apply it on top of codes that are already on the website. So let's say if a candle is already 40% off, you could apply my Erica15 and get an additional 15% off. So that's the awesome part about it that you can stack my coupon code with the or with the coupon that's already on the website so like thank you so much kringle this is the coolest whoa i want to share this experience with you guys because obviously it's not possible without you guys this is what i'm seeing so cool i do see oh my god all these candles are like hidden i'm gonna have to put this down because i'm about to make a mess like they're just candles hidden and like Oh, Ooh. let me put this down. Did y'all just see that drop? I know y'all saw that drop. Didn't break. It didn't break. You see, so I'm gonna open these little balls. I don't know what they are. Very excited. I will say, so the lady that reached out to me from Kringle Company did ask what type of scents I prefer. So I did, I think I believe I told them sweet, gourmand, fruity, minty. I'm not exactly too sure, but I did say that. Ooh, oh wow, there's so many of these. So these are their daylight candles. So they come like this. I will show the, I will show everything to you individually. So this is blueberry French toast. Oh my Lord. Is this not the cutest thing ever? You take the lid off and it's a candle. Oh. Oh my God, hold on. This smells familiar. Oh, it smells so good. Blueberry French toast. Is there scent notes on here? No. Oh, it smells just like a blueberry. I don't know, like, it smells like cinnamon, blueberry. Well, I guess cinnamon is in French toast. Oh, this is delicious. So these are just kind of like little one-time candles that you can kind of try them out, see if you like the scent, see if you like the candle. This is perfect, is it not? And then you also have like my coupon code for 15% off. So, hey, this packaging is adorable. That is adorable. Oh, this smells really good. If you like blueberry scents, this is really, really good. As I mentioned before, this is my first time smelling Kringle Company. And just based off this first candle, it smells very clean. It doesn't smell chemically. I will let you know if it does, but so far, that blueberry scent was a very clean smell. It didn't smell like too fake or artificial. And the next one up is Cranberry. So I'm not reading that wrong. It doesn't say Cranberry, it says Cranberry. This packaging. Ooh. Okay, so this one 
smells like cranberry and some type of like balsam type of leavesy woodsy smell. It's a fresh cranberry. Oh, okay, that's really good. That's really good. Mm, I like this one. This is amazing because, so that's what it looks like. This is amazing again, because you could just get these like little samples and you don't have to, oh, sorry. Sorry, I just got distracted mid-sentence because I, I saw the next one is candy cane and I just meant, I love mint. I love candy cane, I love pepper pint. So this one I'm so excited about. Oh, okay. Yep, so candy cane. So their scents are very clean. It doesn't smell artificial. It doesn't feel chemically. This smells like I have a fresh candy cane that I just licked next to me. That smells really good. I'm going to light one of these up in a moment. I'm going to open all of them and light one up because I'm so curious how they burn. And then I want it to burn throughout the video. Matter of fact, gone. Okay. One up is ooh, peach bellini. Guys, these scents are so fresh. Like, smells like an authentic, like, oil. Oh, this is really good. This smells really good. If you know anything about me, I'm not a big fan of peach scents because I feel like other places don't do it well. But this smells so good. It smells like an authentic peach. Wow. The fragrance oils they use are amazing. Oh. I wonder if this is a play on Fifty Shades of Grey. So this is just called Grey. And I feel like it's going to smell like a man's cologne or something. I'm lighting this one. Oh my god. Ooh, I'm lighting this one. It smells like a man, like a sexy man. Oh lord. Oh, I'm lighting this one right now. Ah, uh, no, I wanted to save it, but so this is the one I'm lighting right now. Funny enough, so this is, I do have a wick cutter. This is from Yankee Candle, so it's his father. Cut Electric lighter. Boom. So, oh, I have to light this one. I have to. That way we can see. Oh my gosh. You know what the thing is? There's a lot of men's cologne. Uh, there's a lot of candles out here that do smell like men's cologne, like mahogany and up that alley. That smell very much like Abercrombie and Fitch. But this one, I would say it smells more like, if I would compare it, it's like, this is like the Chanel and the other one would be like the Abercrombie and Fitch. Like this smells like a very elegant, rich, expensive men's cologne. Like it's not overwhelming. It just smells good. Next one is Macintosh Apple. Mm, it just smells exactly like an apple. No, like there's nothing around it. Like no side notes, no nothing else. Just very basic core apple. Last little pile. <gasps> yes, I see another peppermint twist. I'm so excited. I'll be honest with you. I did not want to light the candy cane because I didn't want to like burn it yet. But now I see another one and I'm excited. But this one's peppermint twist, not candy cane. Mm. So it does smell just like peppermint. It's like a little bit sweeter than candy cane. Really good. They just smell so authentic. I know I keep saying that word, but they just smell so clean. It doesn't have that chemical smell. I know you guys know what I'm talking about because in a lot of my candle videos in the comment sections, we've gone back and forth a lot of us about how certain certain candles do smell like chemically, like it doesn't smell like it doesn't smell real and like, you know, it doesn't smell real, but these ones smell very authentic. It doesn't have like that nasty like made up smell. This is salted waffle cone. Mm, yeah, it smells, I don't smell the salted. To me, it just smells like a waffle cone. Like you just walked inside of an ice cream shop and they just rolled up a fresh waffle cone like right off the iron, the hot iron. Ooh, that's really good. It smells like waffle. Ooh. Oh, they are, oh, one more. Winter sangria. Don't tell me I'm about to become obsessed with these little ones because I'm loving these little ones. So winter sangria. Oh, 
Oh, this one's a complex smell. I'm, I'm getting a couple layers. I smell berries. And I'm smelling like a hint of a... Is it a citrus? Not a citrus. A lime, maybe? I don't know what I'm smelling, but it smells really good. What goes in sangria, guys? I don't know. But it smells really good. It's a fruity, sweet smell. Oh, that's really good. This is it for these little candles. These little ones. How exciting. I've never seen this before. Sent me nine of them. Like, beyond grateful. The three wick candle. Do you see how this is packaged? Do they have scent notes on the bottom? Ooh, they do not have scent notes on the bottom. So y'all just gonna have to... So we're just gonna have to do this together. Figure out the scents together. Which is okay. My nose is up for the job. The, ooh, oh. Look at that, y'all. So it's Northern Lights, one of my bucket list destinations. I'm assuming this is gonna smell like a fresh, cause I see mountains, I see ice, I see snow. This is probably cause I said I like mint. Or it's just, they just threw it in because you have to discover new scents. Oh, it's, it's, okay, yeah. This is like that eucalyptus, fresh air, ocean air. Not salty, but like just clean air. Oh, that smells really good. This smells really, really good. I, funny enough, I feel like I'm at the Northern Lights. It just smells really good. It smells very fresh, very clean. I do pick up the hint. I think it's a eucalyptus in here because it's. I do get like the note of something. I don't know what it is. Oh, that's really good. That is really good. Northern Lights, if you like clean scents, if you like outdoor air type of scents, Northern Lights, this is really good. Wow, that's really good. Oh, I saw it. I saw it, I saw it, I saw it. Christmas for me. I'm so happy I didn't open it this whole time because now I'm having such a better day. In my previous video, I mentioned I'm having like a week from hell and this is just making me so, so happy. So thank you so much again, Kringle, because this is making me feel a lot better from the week I've been having. So this is Christmas cookie dough. Can you look at that? Mmm, yep. It smells like cookie dough. I smell sugar cookie. It smells very clean. Oh, I kind of want to light this one up too. It smells very much like a Christmas cookie dough. Funny enough, I smell like the dough of it. Like, I smell like the raw dough of it. So it doesn't smell like a baked cookie. It smells like the dough of the cookie. Oh, that's really good. A winner. Winner. That smells really good. First crate dead. What are these huge things? I was wondering why I couldn't get it out, out of the box. New York chocolate. says hot chocolate. I'm trying to pull them all out first before one. You guys will get to see it before me. Blueberry muffin. Oh my god. These are huge. Y'all see this? How many ounces is this? 22 ounces. Lord, that is huge. Oh, they're made in Massachusetts. The one time I don't wear my Patriots hat. I'm gonna do the blueberry one first because I'm a sucker for hot chocolate. So I'm gonna save the hot chocolate. Y'all, this, do you see this glass? Kringle. So this is blueberry muffin. Again, there are no set notes on the bottom. It says it is 22 ounces. Oh, 100 hours of burn time. This is going nowhere. Yep. This is literally a blueberry pie. I know it says muffin, but just, it smells like a juicy, juicy, freshly baked blueberry at the oven. Oh, that smells so good, you guys. That smells so good. I'm so impressed. This candle, it they just smell so clean. I wonder, they just smell so clean. I did just confirm they are soy candles. That's I think that has a lot to do with why everything smells so fresh and clean. Like they smell so clean. I did see on the website you can pick there are paraffin wax if that's what you prefer, but there are also soy wax and these just they smell so clean. Oh, that smells delicious. It smells like a blueberry, juicy, juicy blueberry um dessert or pie or muffin just smells so good now this one y'all this one 
hot chocolate, y'all. Look at that. Just look at that. Look at that. I don't I I might not ever. Well, it's a hundred hours, so I will burn it, but. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hold on. It's melted. <laughs> I, do not, do you, I know you guys see that. It's melted. Oops. So I was just saying how I'm never going to burn this, but it melted itself. I do blame myself. As I mentioned, it has been sitting in a box for over a month and LA is a hundred degrees. Well, it just got cooler, but it has been sitting in here for a very long time. So I do blame myself for this jar coming melted. That is interesting. That is interesting, but okay. Oh, oh, oh just smelling literally hot chocolate like it feels like i have a mug of hot chocolate in front of me i smell the cream i smell the chocolate oh that smells really good i don't know if marshmallow is supposed to be a note or it's just because uh, like for the decoration purposes but i don't smell marshmallow i literally just smell chocolate and cream it's a winner it's a winner if you like hot chocolate scents it smells like a very 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 authentic hot chocolate and the last layer bear with me Tangle did all this i had nothing to do with any of this they sent me all of this oh <laughs> eucalyptus mint look at that I, I mentioned to you guys that i told them i like uh, mint um eucalyptus smells so i already know exactly what this is gonna smell like mm -hmm. oh this smells so relaxing so it's eucalyptus mint it smells very relaxing this is something you would burn in your office. This is something you would burn after a stressful day. It just smells so soothing. It smells fresh. It smells minty. It smells calming and relaxing. You could burn this during a bath, during a self-care day. Oh, this smells really, really relaxing. Did my tone even just relax? Like, I feel like I just got relaxed. It smells really good. It's eucalyptus and mint. There's not many other ways to describe the scent besides relaxing, calming, minty, <laughs> eucalyptus-y. Smells really good. Two more. What is, whoa, what is this? Midnight snow. Oh, I'm starting to smell it. Guys, I'm starting to smell gray. Starting to smell gray. Yep. I'm starting to smell him. I thought my boyfriend walked into my room, but he did not graded mr gray walked into my room that smells really good huh, i never thought i would say mr gray walked into my room that smells really good even throughout all these scents i've been smelling i can smell that definitely and it's tiny it's tiny so midnight snow i have no idea what this is going to smell like because the brown wax is throwing me for a loop so i don't expect anything i don't know Midnight snow. Oh, 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 oh. This is a fresh smell. Of course, midnight snow. It smells, I would say, equal to the eucalyptus type of smell. It is clean. It's outdoors. Oh, so this one, is this one bigger than this one? So this is actually 24 ounces. It says 100 to 150 hours of burn time. So these are even bigger than these ones. This smells so good. It is clean. Oh, it smells like winter. It smells really clean. Oh, it smells really good. I don't I don't know how to describe this smell. It just smells clean. It smells like outside fresh air. It's also another relaxing scent, I would say. Very good. Last candle. I haven't seen it yet. Let's see, what is it? Ooh, pumpkin cheesecake. That's cool. Oh, cheesecake. Oh my God, this smells like cheesecake. Holy shoot. This smells so good. I don't know why this just made me happy. I just had all those like relaxing scents and then my vibe was just relaxed and mellowed and chilled. And this just made me so happy because it just smells like cheesecake. <laughs> I'm actually lactose intolerant. So I think that's why I like my scents that are very like cakey and doughy and stuff because I can't really have cheesecakes and all those yummy, delicious desserts. And this is making me crave one so bad. I'm not necessarily getting the pumpkin, 
Maybe the pumpkin will come out when I burn it more because I'm not getting the pumpkin. I'm so, so thankful and grateful for Kringle Company for sending me all these. I never in my wildest dreams thought um, a company would send me something, especially so large. Did you see how many candles I just got? That was a lot of candles. I think what I'm going to do is it is the Christmas season. It's the holiday season. I do want to do a giveaway. I don't know because I kind of want to be selfish because I loved all these scents. But I do want to maybe give away like so you guys can experience it as well. You know what? I'm not going to be greedy. Kringle sent this to me for free. So I'm not going to be greedy and I will give away. I will not be greedy. It is the season of giving. So I will do a giveaway. Because it was so nice of Kringle to give me this stuff. And I feel like it's only fair to give back. I think Midnight Snow. I want to give away Midnight Snow because this is the biggest jar. This was the biggest candle. So I do want to give away this one. Nothing's wrong with the smell. I just because it's the biggest jar. This one burns up to 150 hours. I want to give away Midnight Snow. As I mentioned. Oh, but this smells so good. It's a very fresh, clean scent. I would almost say like a hint of eucalyptus. It's a relaxing scent. It smells really good. If you guys are interested in winning the Kringle Candle Company Midnight Snow Candle, go ahead and subscribe down below. Like, thumbs up this video and leave a comment down below. Ooh, what should you guys leave a comment? Actually, you know what? Leave a comment down below. Have you guys ever tried Kringle Company? And if you have tried Kringle Company, um, what's your favorite candle from there? Because I'm definitely going to go on the website. I'm going to use my own coupon code and buy some more candles because yes. But yeah, leave a comment down below. What candle have you tried for them? Tried them before? And if you have, which one? That's it. That's how easy the giveaway is to win this candle, guys. Subscribe to my channel, thumbs up the video, and leave a comment. Have you tried Kringle Company before? So it's either yes or no, and if you have which candles you like from them. That's really it, guys. So I do want to give one to you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching this long, long video. If you made it to the end, thank you so much for watching this. And if you made it to the end, you get to see the giveaway. So... Thank you so much and I will see you in my next video and thank you again to Kringle Company for sending me these amazing candles. My heart is so full.